I want the change to happen. I want a change in Washington. I don't want things to go the way they've been going for a long period of time, even under Democrats. And uh, the war, of course, I, and I want to see a health program. Right now, I, you know, to, I think the country's in a mess, and I think that uh, it's going to take a real job to straighten it out. But we notice that young people are coming out for Obama, and they know that they need to make a change. Uh, Washington, you know, to some degree is broken, and uh, uh, we've got to straighten it out so it represents the people, not the special interests. Too many of the seniors are concerned about changes. And changes are really important because, remember, we lived through when Roosevelt, um, senior and our generation had a choice between Roosevelt and Hoover. People chose the right path. During the Civil War, people had a choice between Lincoln and, and, and the Douglas, and they chose the right person. During World War II, the same thing. We had Truman uh, understood what the problems of the American people were, and people chose the right path. This is our America, and we have been fighting for our America. It's our future. Even more than that, it's our children, our grandchildren's future. I'm 82, I'm fine. People around me, about the same age or older. They can't look into the future of 10, 20, 30 years down the road. For we seniors, the time is now. The future is now. How do we get through this period? It's, it's Senator McCain has no program. He has nothing and we have no optimism. If we don't vote for the Democrats, we have no, uh, we look forward to a time there'll be no optimism at all. We need to have a democratic president because we cannot continue with the type of policies that the Bush administration uh, has been following. We have to change completely. Senior who have gone through bad times, understand bad times. We have to help build a future, not only for our children, but our grandchildren. We don't expect miracles, but we want to know that our kids, our grandchildren are going to be all right. My children are the most important to me, and so are my grandchildren. And so I'm appealing to people to think hard when you go into the cash your ballot.